Dr. Chris Bariomunsi, Minister for ICT and National Guidance, was the chief guest representing Minister of Education and Sports, Janet Kataham Seveni. In her speech read by Bariomunsi, Minister of Education Janet Katam Seveni applauded the Board of Trustees of Bishop Stewart University for sustaining the university for years, making great achievements. She also thanked the university for supporting the government effort in provision of higher education to its people. She urged them to invest in research. I would like to applaud the Board of Trustees for sustaining this university for now over 20 years and seeing it grow from strength to strength over the years. I have noted the various achievements over those years and we greatly appreciate these, these developments. As you start the third decade of your existence, government expects to see more research and publication taking place at the university. This is one way through which you will contribute to the transformation of society. Research and publication are a unique feature of universities that sets them apart from other educational institutions. The academicians often proclaim to each other that you either publish or perish. I therefore challenge you to ensure that this university enhances its capacity not only through teaching and learning, but also provide solutions to the problems of our communities through action and research, creativity and innovations. Janet Mseveni challenged universities to embrace regional integration and play an active role by welcoming equal treatment to all students from within the region. She also urged them to deliver work class services to the students. In his speech, Bishop Sheldon congratulated students but urged them to innovate and be good leaders who should always go the way of Jesus Christ. Our esteemed graduates, congratulations once again. I urge you to be innovative young entrepreneurs who will always seize opportunities that will always come your way. Be good leaders who create opportunities for tomorrow and always know the way, go the way and show the way of Jesus Christ. Stand for values that matter. Professor Kenneth Kagame, the university council chairperson, thanked parents for the heavy expenditure incurred in the education of their children. He noted that in the 20 years the university has achieved a lot, including getting a charter and infrastructure development. Join me to thank the parents, the parents of these graduates who are here present and who are observing on social media and TV, that it has been a long waiting and a heavy expenditure from for about 20 years. From when you saw this kid leaving your house for nursery school to now when you see him graduating. May God reward you abundantly. Our journey as a university has been a short 20 years, but in the 20 years we have achieved quite a lot. Our student numbers have raised from 200 to 5,000. Today I got worried about seats I see the place full and people are still coming in. So we're very proud of that. We achieved the charter in a record time and it was a major achievement. 1,661 students were awarded degrees, diplomas, masters and PhDs in different academic disciplines. They included two PhDs, 43 masters, 119 postgraduate diplomas, 10,088 bachelors, 363 diplomas and 46 certificates.